This is my true story of how my dad rescued me from a toilet. The village I come from is called Broughton and my dad is very Devonian. Like he's very, oh, I believe every meal should be meat and potatoes. What's a vegetable? We're very different. They don't often get new things in Broughton. They've only recently got electricity and there is a new gym that had opened up. So I was very excited about going. And my dad is very competitive. Like he's all like, oh, that doesn't look heavy. I could lift that with my penis. That's genuinely one of his go-to phrases. Oh, well maybe I'll come with you. We can have a, a lift off competition. It was like, look dad, like just please, just like stay home, like don't embarrass me. Oh, probably just gonna do a Spice Girls dance routine. Which is very offensive because actually it was Little Mix. So I arrive at the gym. I think calling it a gym is generous. It was effectively a converted warehouse that had yet to be converted. I went in and it was completely full of like total meatheads, like lads with arms as big as their necks. If it was something I was watching on, I don't know, Pornhub, yes, I'd be into it. But here in real life where it's threatening, no. So I went up to the smallest meathead. I assumed he was their leader. I tapped him lightly on the shoulder and said, where is your sprung floor dance studio? He said something I couldn't quite understand. <clears throat> so just decided to get changed and look for myself. Only thing is, there doesn't seem to actually be a changing room. I decide to go and get changed in the toilet. I discover the toilet is outside. As soon as I shut the door on the toilet, I immediately regretted my decision. This thing was a coffin. So I get changed as quickly as possible, turn around, go to try and leave, and the door is just jammed, like it's jammed. And I realize I may well be trapped. So I'm genuinely thinking, I'm gonna die. Like I'm gonna die in this toilet, protein, gym-based horror fest. Then I remember I've got a mobile phone, but the only person available is my dad. So embarrassing, but I text him, stuck in toilet, please help, don't be a dick about it. So after a period of time has passed, to me it felt like four months, I'm told it was 40 minutes. I see these fingers curl themselves into the crack of the door and these meaty digits start prying this door open. And then the door just swings open and there stood behind this hulk of muscle is my dad grinning ear to ear in a gym kit. Because he's decided, wouldn't now be the best time to try that competition? So I say to dad, okay, I will do this competition. If I can lift what you can lift, will you do the little mixed dance routine? Now, Devonians can never say no to a challenge. So my dad instantly accepts. And so we do our little competition. But what my dad doesn't know is I've been working out. So I managed to lift everything he lifted, even when he stopped using his penis and started using his hands, which meant my dad had to do the little mix dance routine. And dad actually started getting into it. He was pretty good for an older guy and all the meatheads were loving it so much, so he started to join in. They didn't really. They told us to leave because it was a health and safety hazard. But sometimes I still dream about the idea of me and six meatheads competing on Britain's Got Talent, dancing to Sweet Melody. Ah!